I came down today to work on this clay and uh, got a call from a potential client who wants to come by and talk to me about a possible commission. And so I don't know how much I'm going to be able to do today. And uh, so I'll either come back tomorrow to work on it or I'll finish, get back on it later on this afternoon. And uh, we'll have to just play it by ear for now. All right. Be right back or I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> One of the two. Time to play with some play. I'm going to do what I can for now until he gets here. I want to put some kind of a texture in his, uh, the eagle body. Which means I'm going to have to turn the eagle up sideways here. I want to kind of blend this eagle into his leg because it's part of the dream he's having and I don't want to have it just suddenly coming out of his body. I want to have it and I got to figure out how I'm going to do that. Hmm. Now I gotta wait for my clay to soften up a bit. I just got down here, got it down here, and uh, yeah, I've got some work to do on this. All right, I realize I made this leg too long. That's why you get away from something for a while till you can come back and take a better look at it. They have to run a wire from the eagle. The clay has hardened up uh, over the weekend, and uh, so it's uh, a little harder to get it to stick. Oh, I know what to do. I know what to do. Heat up the clay where it joins up with the uh, figure of the uh, eagle. With a little flame. All right, now. You know what I think what I'll do is just redo that leg. I'll have to come back when my clay gets soft. It's not soft enough yet. Yeah, I gotta put a wire in there because that leg keeps lifting off of the uh, eagle's body. So, there's no shortcut. I'm going to have to just do it. All right, I'm just heating up the uh, armature wire so that I can hopefully stick this up into the eagle. There we go. I'll let that cool. 
that'll solidify it into the uh, e the eagle's body. I'm gonna lower that a little bit. There we go. All right. I'm just I'm still waiting for the clay to soften. Anyway. <laughs> okay, that'll give me more of a solid base to work on this leg. This is the leg that's going to be most exposed. It's going to have uh, his leg back here. Anyway, I'm just going to try to do this as best I can. I think I need to change the angle of my camera so you can see what I'm doing. I'm using my mannequins for the muscles and uh, trying to get those right. Oh, I hit cameras out of the way. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right, I just got a text. They're coming over now, so I'm going to have to end my video today. I got a little bit done. Sorry it wasn't a lot. But uh, I didn't think I'd even get this much done. I'll have to work on his right leg next week. Or not next week, next next time. And uh, figure out how I'm going to finish that foot off. I think I'm going to make it a, him wearing a moccasins. He'd at least be wearing those. And he'd be wearing probably a loincloth, but I can't put the loincloth on him because he's covered by the eagle. I'm happy the way this turned out. And uh, 
I just have to see if uh, the idea fleshes out well in bronze. Just gonna finish off the base here. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.